Okay, so adding products to WooCommerce is pretty easy. First, we have to do is make our categories. For example, in this tutorial, I'm going to pick sports as my main category. And for subcategories, I'm picking indoor sports and outdoor sports. And then they will contain the products. For example, bowling, basketball, and badminton will be in uh, indoor sports, while cricket, football, and soccer will be in outdoor sports. So let's add the categories first and then we will add the products so log into your dashboard and go to products select categories now let's type a name for our categories we decided to go with sports so let's type sports Mm, we will not select anything here you can write a description if you want but it's not necessary just click on add new category once you do that you will see a sports category right here one more step you have to do is edit this category that you added scroll down and you will see a banner type in this banner type select banner block and type shop shop banner you have to do this for all the categories and then just update the category okay that's so that was our parent category. Now let's add the subcategories indoor and outdoors. So now in the subcategories you will going to you will be selecting the parent category which is sports. Sports is the parent category and indoor sports is the subcategory. And once again, go to edit. Once again, banner block and type shop banner. Okay. And update the category. Now let's add the second subcategory, which was outdoor sports select the parent category as sports once again and create it once again select banner block and type shop banner click update you have to do this for every category that you add okay once it's done uh, let's go to our shop page which is slash shop right now we don't have any categories any products here no products are found let's refresh the page If we refresh, we will see sports, and within sports, we have two subcategories indoor and outdoor sports. Okay, now let's add some products. Go to products, all products, <coughs> click on create product or add new button. So let's see, let's add badminton first. Okay, 
okay this area right here is the big description so for now I'm just gonna copy some random text you can write the description about the product here and once again this is the big description and make sure you select product categories this is the parent category and badminton is an indoor sport so let's select these two now let's select the product image upload let's upload all of these first I'm gonna select this. This will be the main image for the product which will be shown right here. So if you have extra images for the same product, just add them in the gallery images. Okay. Now let's move down. Okay. So this is where you will input the price. Let's say we are selling badminton racket, so $34 or pounds. And if you want to schedule a sale on this, you can also write it here. If you want, that's up to you. And then there is SKU units, stocks, in stock, out of stock. That depends on the product same goes for shipping there's not much to do here you can just add the price and leave it as it is and that would be enough now this right here product chart description it appears in the quick view of the product I will show you that later and that's pretty much it that's all you had to do to add a product let's click on publish once it's published we will go back and refresh the shop page if you see now we have one category uh, sorry one product in sports and one in indoor sports which is basically badminton so if you click here It will show quick details of the product and as you can see this is the short description that I wrote down here this one and if I click on the product it will show you the full details regarding that product mm, this one right here okay so we don't need that right now let's go back to shop now let's add another product but this time we will add the product in outdoors so let's select uh, I guess we will add soccer Once again, copy the big description and paste it here. So once again, you will select parent category and then the subcategory, which is outdoor. Okay. Let's select an image. This is the soccer image. Uh, let's add a price, let's say $20. Uh, I'm going to write this as short description. Mm, let's publish. 
Now if we go back in products and refresh the page. Now we have two products, and if I select support, uh, if I select just uh, sports, it will show both of the products. If I select outdoor, it should only show soccer, and if I select indoor, it should only show badminton. And for sports, uh, it's the parent category, so it should show all the products in the subcategories okay and that's how you would do it